says go and they racing away not a bad beginning for a field of this size captain of rock sprouted out the machine by a length and a quarter to the good Right there, Sabre Charge gets up to race a share of second. Grasshopper's now edging on by and goes to a clear second. Sabre Charge, air salute. Warrior Poets around runners, the yellow cap, Interferometer, reprieve towards the inside, a pink cap, pinball. Further back in the run, high five. Interferometer just ran green and ran away from runners there. Comes around horses, Interferometer. At this point in time, you're going to find Queensbridge. Queensbridge is racing about seven or eight lengths off them. Bold Rain also tries to get a little bit closer. Winter Wolf just in the picture, then comes Fire Bolt, and they're giving the leaders about 10 or 11 length start. Festival Star gets some urgings towards the outside. Approaching the 700 meter mark, Captain of Rock, Black Sleeves and Cap in front. Interferometer continues to climb over them on the outside, gets a little bit closer. Grasshoppers between them, the Red Souls. Air Salute, Red Cap to the inside, gets a reminder or two. Sabre Charge Corners in fifth position. Warrior Poet to the outside, trying to close in Queen's Bridge, a green cap, pinballs on the inside. Coming to the 400 meter marker, Captain of Rock makes his way to the outside with a commanding two and a half length advantage. Salsa Queen looks to run on, pinballs on the inside side interferometer bold rain's got five lengths to make up 200 meters to go captain of rock the leader salsa queen now starts to unwind a good looking challenge on the inside and here comes salsa queen at captain of rock captain of rock by a neck salsa queen is grabbing stride for stride on the post got there from captain of rock air salute then it's a photo between saber charge and bold rain Number 15, Salsa Queen. You've got to say a good ride here from the rider aboard, Kelvin Abib. He just times it dead right. You see, not animated in the irons. He's just keeping this one balanced. The daughter of Mumbo in Seattle from the James Goodman stable. Salsa Queen times it dead right to win that neck decision. Captain of Rock, everything went right for Captain of Rock. Was there, shot away at the right moment, stayed on second. Towards the inside, air salute, sabre charge, then came... Bold drain, pinball, grasshopper, reprieve, interferometer, Queensbridge firebolt. Just looking at Salsa Queen, took her place last time out in that feature race behind Legend, that one million rand race I think it was on that occasion. But Legend came through to win on that occasion by a good margin. Salsa Queen brings that maiden form back here and quickened up at the business end for James Goodman, Advocate Shepstons, the Armstrongs, De La Vera's, bred by Matons Hook. Number 15, Salsa Queen to the fore, back to the studio. We've seen the running of the first leg of the pick six Scottsville race four over 1600 meters. It's gone the way of the three-year-old daughter of Mumbo in Seattle, Salsa Queen, who was trained by James Good Goodman and ridden to victory by a Kelvin Habib. Uh, James, barring its uh, last uh, run, its form's actually there. Oh, yeah. The form's there. I saw none of you guys liked it. You know, 16 rand on the tights. I don't think too many did. Well, we thought she had a big chance. We were very happy with her and um, very happy to be able to have a winner for these guys and to have a winner. Geez, we've had a miserable couple of months. You know, these horse sickness injections, when you've got small yards, whew, it's hard to bounce back. And it's been a long time coming. But thanks to Steve and um, Bruce, you know, Bruce is an old, old character. And um, he was meant to be here today. I don't know where he is. He's probably hiding with his mates. You know, lunch on Sunday is more important than coming to the races to have a winner. But I'm, I'm so thrilled for these guys. You know, they've been very helpful from, to me. And um, I must congratulate young Calvin Habib because he has done all the work on her and he deserves a winner. He's been having a bit of a lean time with us. And he, he rode a cracking good race, so I'm very pleased about him. Yeah, finished off its race really well. Yeah, she's a, she's a sister to Smart Mart, and um, she's, he's a bit nuts as well. So she stays well, and every run of hers you've seen she's been running on, but the last run was, was a bit strong for her. Anyway. Great stuff. Great to have the winner. Well done. Good. Let's get uh, Calvin a bib in. Calv, uh, take us through the race. Yeah, um, she got left uh, in the beginning of the, the race, and I was a little bit worried because I wanted to be up there. 
But uh, going through the race, she always traveled well, and uh, it was just come, she came into the straights and she pulled me through. We had a little bit of a tight position going through about the 300, but she just pulled through, and uh, she looked like she wasn't going to get the other horses staying on, but she, she fought down uh, deep and she won a nice race. Well, you didn't panic. <laughs> yeah, no, you must never panic. Just ke keep a cool head and uh, pray that the horse can do it for you and you can just help her along. I have to thank Mr. Goodman. He's uh, really been helping me a lot. And uh, we went through, as you said, we went through a bit of a bad patch, but hopefully it's uh, all the way from here. And then to the, all the owners in, the, in this horse, uh, well done to them. Congrats. Stop win. Thank you very much. And to the Academy and the Rowdy Masters for helping us. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. Thanks, Calv. Thank you. Would uh, Mr. Shepson like to come through and uh, have a word? He must be over the moon uh, with the victory. Uh, it, it, it's, its last one was a little bit disappointing, but it, 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 to James, I said it had the form prior to that. But you know, the last runner was that strong field, that, that million dollar race. She ran nine and a half lengths off him. That wasn't really that bad. And before that, she had some nice form. And uh, she stays, you know, her, her full brother, he goes two miles. So, um, yeah, she's very promising. We're very happy. Well, the beauty about that is you can look forward to runs over, over further and you should have a bit of fun with this one. Yes, no, absolutely. And uh, I must thank James. He fancied her a bit today, gave me some confidence. And uh, Calvin, I mean, he rides her every morning and uh, he rode a fantastic race. So yeah, and that's all you want, come to the races expecting be, to be competitive and you in the winner's box. Absolutely, absolutely, fantastic. Lovely stuff, enjoy the win. Ta, thanks. There we've heard it from all concerned uh, with number 15, Salsa Queen, the three-year-old daughter of uh, Mumbo in Seattle, who's come forward to win the first leg of the pick six. Scottsville, a race for number 15, Salsa Queen.